Get set. Go. 45 athletes took to the track at Ackerman Center in Canby. This is the culmination of a year's worth of work for some of these competitors. It's a great opportunity for athletes to be able to see what's possible next. The athletes range from preschool to 18 years old and have different levels of visual impairment. In the track events, some athletes have a guide running with a tether running along with them. Other athletes, like Ellis Stromquist, can do it on their own. The lane lines are white on a like red background and that's enough contrast for me to see. But sometimes I swerve in my lane and I just have to check myself. She competes in just about everything, but likes the running events best. I feel when I do it, it it's just so many wonderful people I can talk to and meet. And it's always nice to get a hug from dad at the finish line. I'm super proud. She's a good athlete, which it's nice to see. And she's progressed a lot. You know, she's been here since kindergarten coming every year. and. She's gotten better every year. It's really great to watch. For Gwen Mitchell, track and field is better than just about anything. It's the best. Like, I love it more than I love playing piano. And I love it more than I love singing. Track is just, like, fun. It's also a good time for her mom. Love it. And I've seen all the other kids and growing and getting better every year. Go! The meet ends with the longest events of the day, the 800-meter run and the mile run. It's not easy with the sun bearing down on these runners. They do their best. It doesn't really matter who wins on this day. It's all about finishing and having fun. Art Edwards, KGW Sports.